Hello and welcome to Oz Toy Reviews. It's Oz here and today we're doing something new which is a game review for LEGO World. Now we'll just do a quick review and then if people like it, it gets lots of likes and people comment saying they want more of them then we'll do it like a series. But for now we'll just check it out. So let's not waste time talking about it, let's start the game. Starting out on a creative adventure. Infinite worlds ahead. Infinite possibility. And one goal. To become a master builder. See how these magicians of the brick use their creative tools. Summoning creatures. Conjuring houses. Flattening mountains. And shaping the land itself. You too can lead that power. Discover and master the creative tools. Collect new bricks, models, and vehicles. Conquer worlds. Make your mark and become. Wow, this game starts well. That was a cool cutscene. Okay, what are we doing now? So we're customizing our person. Okay, we got astronaut or female? No, not female astronaut. Intergalactic girl. <laughs> so intergalactic girl or an astronaut. Not not a female astronaut, no. Um, so what have we got? We can change the outfits. This is kind of cool. Okay, male astronaut suit or female pink suit. Hey, nice hair. Maybe if we do the man with the beautiful hair that will look awesome <laughs> look at that <laughs> that guy's cool all right now we're going to land on our first world now i haven't played this before i'm assuming it's going to be a bit like the lego batman games with the controls but maybe a bit like minecraft pirate who knows playground. it looks nice the graphics Your are amazing first lego world so much to discover. We better listen to the guy. Your rocket took a beating. A few gold bricks. Fix it right up. Okay, cool. So we need gold bricks. Three gold bricks to fix our spaceship. Then I'm assuming we can then fly on to other worlds. Which sounds cool. Now what can we do? Can we climb trees? Like how nimble is this character? Hey, what's happening? Look, a meteorite. Look, a meteorite. <laughs> Let's see what that's about. Wow, it's cool how it deformed the land, like made that big grey uh, crater. Discovery tool. The discovery tool. Ooh. Use the powerful discovery tool to scan and collect new models, outfits, creatures, and vehicles. Once they're in your collection, you can use the tool to summon things into your worlds. Place them nice. precisely okay, cool. where you want them, or fire them into the sky with wild abandon. Getting to grips with the discovery tool is the first step on your journey to become a master builder. Okay, cool. So this looks like it's all about becoming a master builder, just like in the Lego movies, which is very cool. I like the idea. Now that discovery tool, so from what I understand, we just have to scan something once, and then we can reproduce it as much as we like, which is cool. It's not like mining for Minecraft or anything. It's just discovering stuff, which I like. And shooting elephants looks cool too. Now, let's have a look around, get a lay of the land, see what we can see. Out of the way, seagull. Man, I love his hair. <laughs> he looks glorious. Okay, spaceships. So what can we scan? There we go. We have a big flower. 
New discovery type unlocked. Did we get the seagull? Objects. New discovery type unlocked. Ah, we did. Creatures. I love the narrator. Sounds grand. Okay, so we've got the seagull already. Banana tree? Yeah, nice. Pig? Oh! This looks like a little ranch or something. Hey, we got the gate! We can even like get buildables like that. That's cool. Now can we open it? Uh, I don't know how to put my tool away yet, so we'll just we'll just remove the gate. Who cares about keeping your animals in there? Hey, we're on the pig! <laughs> okay, I'm loving this game just for the fact I can ride a pig. It's now my favorite game. Hey, I love that sign. Okay, chickens, pigs. Um, this lady likes my discovery tool, I think. She's a pirate lady. Nice. What else can we discover? Let's see what she wants. What's she on about? Some pigs and chickens is what I need right here, Sebi. I should have put a pirate accent on. Okay, well, I think we've already scanned pigs and chickens. There we go. Now what's happening? Why can't I select the pig? Aha, money! I don't have enough money. But we can afford chickens. Okay, well, we'll do the chickens. Okay, now what's happening? Every time I click to place a chicken, it just brings the menu back. This is a little bit confusing. Maybe I gotta do it further away. Okay, it likes far away chickens, just not close chickens. Let's try again. Cool, okay. I was pressing the same button. I don't know what was different, but who knows. Okay, I've only got 10, uh, whatever you call those, chips or coins or pieces. We need uh, about 1,250, I believe. So let's go smash some stuff like Batman. I wonder if Batman's in this game. That'd be cool. I've kind of done no research on this game. <laughs> I, I probably should have, but uh, it's kind of cool going into a game not having any preconceptions of what it's going to be like or what you're going to see. That New way you're just totally surprised unlocked. by everything. Vehicles. Hey, a rowing boat, that's cool. Ah, I wish I could summon a pig, then I could just ride the pig around everywhere. Okay, there's a lot of controllers to learn. Lots of uh, controls to learn here. I'm getting struggling with uh, the menu systems. Like you press C to put away your discovery tool, but then you have to press a different key. I think it was Q to to bring out your discovery tool. I don't know why it can't just be C to bring it out, put it in, bring it out, put it in. But I don't know. We'll find out. There must be a reason for it. Yeah, this is lovely. I'm happy just like exploring, <laughs> just walking around, bashing trees, breaking grass. Hey, we can afford pigs. Okay, cool. Now, I believe that lady only needed one more pig, the pirate lady. So let's bring it back to her. I could have spawned it there, but riding it's way fun. Aha! Or oh, ahoy! <laughs> I love my hair. Okay, I got a rank. Learn a builder. Nice. The first golden oh, I'd love to keep riding to pigs, but I better, better move builder. on. But you'll need two more gold bricks to fix your rocket. Okay, one down, two to go. And we've got a lot of money if I'm doing that. And what's the stuff? Pirate punch barrel. Uh, pirate throne. Nice. Cool. Campfire. Never go cold again. I wonder if there's like arctic worlds where we need stuff like fire, that would be cool. Okay, can't beat up fire. <laughs> it's not Minecraft. Can't punch things to death. Can you punch fire? No, in Minecraft, oh you can punch the ground where the fire is. Yeah, no you can, that's cool. Okay, what's over here? Ah, another pirate! Ahoy! I need a pirate throne to make this something something a home. I missed it. Do I have a pirate throne? I do. Okay. And I can afford it. Cool. 
There you go. Happy. Happy times. Uh, he's still just telling me he needs a throne. Maybe it's not close enough. We'll move it closer. Maybe we'll just put it on him. <laughs> Why wasn't he reacting to me putting my uh, throne next to him? Maybe he's blind. Maybe he's got the eye patch over the good eye. <laughs> and his dead eye is the one what we can see. Which would make him totally blind. And he's still not happy with all these thrones. It looks like too that uh, you only have to pay once to get an item to use it. And then you can make as many copies of it as you like. Which is cool. Alright, this is a picky pirate. Let's explore, maybe I'm missing something. Maybe if we smash enough of his belongings, then he'll uh, just want us to go away and just accept whatever we give, give him. Okay, we got a cool torch, got pirate flag, that's going to be handy one day. If we get to make our own house, I, I so want a pirate flag on it. Take that, water barrel. I can't believe this guy has black facial hair, but then <laughs> flowing blonde hair. I love it. This guy's the best. Okay, I'm smashing stuff. I'm getting a little bit of money. Nowhere near as much uh, money or, or tokens as I did by doing quests. Um, so I guess that kind of, like it's enough to maybe make it worth exploring, but not so much that you want to just skip the quests, which is probably by design. Okay, smash some more stuff. I should probably be gathering the stuff with my discovery tool, but it's too hard pulling it out all the time. I can't remember what buttons it was. Okay, I give up. I've found a lot of stuff. Let's try them again. Okay, he wants me to use my discovery tool, which I've got. He wanted a pirate throne, which I've got. I will put it down. Happy times. Ah, menus. Again, see, it's tab to bring up those menus, but tab doesn't close the menu. You've got to manually click. Okay, maybe I have to sit on the throne. Nope. Nope. I give up. Let's go somewhere else. We'll come back to him. Hey, a crab. Wow, nice. Anything in here? Hello, hello, hello. Cool fish. Cool shells. Cool everything. I wonder if I can um, use my discovery tool down here. Aha! Captain wants a power clock tower. Oh, man. <laughs> okay ah oh, here we go okay once we've scanned something we can just remove it or manipulate it like that gate we were able to unlock the gate with our discovery tool okay we got some old skeletons they'll be handy maybe awesome okay what well, have we got pirate clock tower cool New discovery type. Brick unlocked. builds. Brick builds. Ah, uh -huh, so that's not just an object. That's like building a building with one click, which is cool. I like it. Yeah, that's massive. Wow. Where can we put it? I want it to look nice. I don't want it to be like floating in the air. So let's try to find a place where it clips nicely. There we go. Good. Perfect. Man, that dude's got some serious majesty going on there. I can just imagine like little lines coming out of his hair like oh, like gold beams. <laughs> Cuz he's so glorious. There's one more and you can lift off to another world. Cool. So back to that pirate dude with his throne, but first let's see what these gold bricks do. 
Okay, the uh, spaceship likes them. I'm happy with that. So this dude is all that stands in our way between us and getting off this planet. I need a pirate throne to make this ship feel like home. Try it again. Ah! I just noticed I had to press space to accept his quest. So for everyone else, I just had to do the thing and he was happy with it. Whereas this dude, I for some reason had to accept his quest before he would, you know, allow me to complete the quest. Say something to know. Weird. It's a weird little thing, but who knows. Okay, I've leveled up Discoverer Builder. So that was only three, three gold, gold bricks, bricks to become a Discoverer, That's and the next exactly one that looked like needed about eight. Needs. Congratulations. Cool, okay, we're out of here. I'm thinking once we get off this island, we'll have a better idea what the game is about. Uh, so that's probably where we'll stop. We'll do this island, we'll, we'll take off, we'll see what's around, we'll maybe see what the next kind of world looks like, and then we'll stop there. Okay, get in there. Cool, that's cute, just like jumping on the pigs. The galaxy map shows you the worlds you have been to, the world you're on, and the worlds you're yet to explore. Collect more gold bricks, and you'll be able to travel farther afield to bigger worlds with more biomes and a huge variety of new discoveries. Okay, nice, nice. And it looks like, how you, see how you can see the seed there on the bottom right hand corner? Um, it looks like, so that would mean every planet is randomized as you land in. Like they might all be pirate planets, but the trees will be in different places, uh, the, the treasures will be in different places, and maybe the quest items will be in different places. So that's cool, it, it adds to the replayability. Okay, this is cool. Back up into space. Okay, I can't really do much. This must be like a loading, loading, loading screen. He's just kind of thinking to himself, just having a chill out time. Okay, we're coming to our next planet. That was easy, that was cool, I liked it. I'm loving this game so far. Oh, volcanoes. Landing looks nice too. Prehistoric peril. Oh, hot ground, hot ground. <laughs> Your rocket's thought bubble indicates how many gold bricks you need until you get to the next reward. But not all worlds have a lot of gold bricks on them. Once you think you've collected as many gold bricks as you can from a world, feel free to travel to another one to find more. Cool, okay. Ah, the sky's falling in. Oh, my mistake. It's one of those meteorites again. Okay guys, now that was awesome. And as I did say, we're just having a quick peek at this game. And then, depending on your feedback and your comments, I'll either continue it or look for another game to try. So I want to hear from you guys. So let me know by uh, writing in the comments, yeah, I love this video, it's awesome, let's keep playing this game. Or uh, like the video, and then depending on how popular it is and how many comments and responses, that will show if I'll keep doing this game. Or if you've got a better game you want me to try, let me know again in the comments. Anyway, I didn't think I'd enjoy that game, but I really did. It was, I'm, I'm tip I want you guys to like this so I can keep playing. Um, but anyway, guys, until next time, have a great week, take care of yourself, and I will catch you next time.